Welcome to Doing Data Science. I am Moni McGee, Associate Professor of Statistical Science at SMU and Co-Faculty Director for the SMU Master of Science in Data Science program. I designed this course, as well as the two statistics courses and Quantifying the World, which you will see at the end of your progression through the program. Doing Data Science is designed as an introduction to the discipline of data science and for the conceptual and computational tools that you will need to complete the degree. The learning outcomes for the course are as follows. To be able to form a testable hypothesis from an unstructured problem. Apply the principles of reproducible research in testing said hypothesis. Use tools such as R, RStudio, Knitter, R Markdown, SAS, Python, and GitHub to organize and document work so that others can reproduce and or continue your work. We will apply basic statistics and graphics to explore data and also use the principles of tidy data to create clean data sets from messy ones. We will also learn to communicate the findings of a project in a clear, concise, and scientific manner. Every unit of the course will have a discussion wall. Some units, you will be asked for a particular discussion question on the reading or, for, or on the asynchronous videos. Other weeks, the discussion will be about a case study or an assignment. When we have a discussion wall assignment, your assignment is to start a thread and answer the thread and answer another thread each week. To get credit, comments need to be substantive. The discussion wall is a good place to also to post issues with downloading software, setting it up, coding, etc. You are encouraged to help each other in this way. One coding rule though, do not post code as an answer or working code anyway as an answer. You may give hints or post pseudocode or maybe post code for a similar problem, but not the code that actually works to answer the assignment that you are doing at the time. Live session attendance is recorded automatically. Some sessions will begin with a short assignment on a weekly reading. There may be a short problem to solve using software during the live session as well. Collaboration and questions are always encouraged. If you need to miss a live session, notify the live session instructor at least 24 hours prior to the session. Make sure you watch the recording and do any assignments that are missed for the live session. As far as course expectations, assigned reading should be done before live session. Such material will not necessarily be repeated in class, but you may need that material for answering questions during the class. Some weeks, there will be a short quiz on reading material at the beginning of the live session. You should also learn to search out answers to questions before asking me or a classmate. This is really important for a data scientist to learn. The skill of being able to search through material and try to understand what's going on before you ask a question is really important. And the discussion wall, remember, is open 24 seven. Also expect to be frustrated. Working with data can be tough. In particular, munging data can be tough and rather frustrating and difficult and time consuming. Figuring out how to make R, Python, all of that work can also be very difficult. And dealing with missing or erroneous elements is another issue that can be very difficult as well. So you need to be able to work past the frustration and use your curiosity, your humility, and your perseverance as you work through this course. The course text for this particular course are Christopher Grandrude's text on reproducibility in R and selected chapters from Python for Data Analysis by Wes McKinley and selected chapters also from Doing Data Science by Kathy O'Neill and Rachel Shutt. Mentioned, uh, Christopher, Christopher Gandrude's text is available from GitHub. If you can figure out how to work all the make files that he used to create the text, you can have it for free. The Python and data analysis text is also available as a free PDF download, and you have to figure out how to get it, of course. The O'Neill and Shutt text is available from O'Reilly Media. In the spirit of searching out answers before asking questions, Please fi try to find these books on your own before asking your professor where to get them. They are all readily available. Now let me introduce you to your best friends. 
Your classmates are some of your best friends. They come from different backgrounds. Chances are one of them has experience in an area that you do not have experience. These faces on a screen will become your friends during the course and of course as the program moves forward. Use the course discussion board and set up group study sessions either in person or via the LMS. Websites that will be important for you to use as well are Stack Overflow, R Help, Python Help, and SAS Help. Google can also be very helpful. When you have an error in your code, you can type in the error text. Maybe someone else has encountered it and posted a workaround. Again, welcome to the Master of Science in Data Science program and to the course Doing Data Science. I expect that you learn a great deal about the data science process in this course, and I hope that you will enjoy the learning process as well.